Screen mirroring is a very useful feature which enables us to cast one device's display on another. This could be used in situations when you'd like to play games or watch videos or photos on a bigger screen. So today I'll be telling you on how you can connect your smartphone to a Windows PC using the Miracast feature inbuilt in the Windows system. And to those of you who don't know me, my name is Utsav and I create tech related videos that can be used by any common person to help himself out in their day to day life. Now without wasting any further time, let's start our video. Now before I tell you on how to cast your screen on Windows, first you should know whether your device even supports Miracast or not. So in order to find that out, press Windows plus R key on your keyboard and then type TXTIAG and press enter. Then after a couple of seconds, this box will pop up. Now here on the bottom left corner, you'll see that something is loading. Once it's loaded, click on save all information. Here select the file location to be your desktop and then click on save and then exit out of this box. On the desktop, you'll find this notepad file, so just open it up. Here you can see under the Miracast option that it says available. If it's not available, then I'm sorry to say but your system doesn't support Miracast. But I really wish that it does. So now that we know whether our device supports Miracast or not, let's move forward. So first click on the search button down here and type connect. And then open this option up. If you see something like this stating that your device doesn't support Miracast, don't be afraid as I've got a simple fix for this. So what you need to do to fix this is simply turn on your Wi-Fi. That's it. And yes, make sure that it's not connected to any other network. So now let's try to open it up again. As you can see that this device is not ready to be connected. So now let's move on to my phone screen. Now we need to enable the cast feature. But before that, turn on the Wi-Fi in your phone and make sure that it's not connected to any other network. Once you have done that, you've got to enable cast in your phone. Now there are a lot of ways by which it can be done. In my phone or maybe in yours, you can find the cast option up here in the notification bar. If you don't find it here, Open up the settings option and look under the display section. It should probably be there. Now since smartphone nowadays use different custom skins on top of Android OS, it's really hard to actually tell where it's gonna be located on your phone. Like in my mom's phone, it's called mirror share. And on my dad's, it's called wireless display. So if you're facing any problems in finding that option, comment me below so that I can guide you on where you can find it. So once we're in the cast option, we need to enable it. So simply tap on these three dots and then enable it if it's not. And once you do that, you'll find your system's name over here. So simply tap on it to start mirroring your screen. Now one thing is to be noted that when you're casting your screen on a PC or laptop, the sound will come from it and not from your phone. Now you can watch your favorite videos and photos or play games on your bigger screen. I actually used a lot of third-party apps to cast my phone screen on PC but they all turned out to be useless and this method was easily the best for casting your screen. So this was it for today guys, I really hope that this video was helpful to you and if it was then make sure to leave the like button turned on, share it with your friends and subscribe to my channel as I try to create very simple videos on topics that can help you out in your daily life. And yes, do not forget to hit the notification bell so that you get notified whenever I upload a new video. So I'll see you in my next one, till then, goodbye.